Good evening all and uh, welcome back to the channel Evas and uh, what's it doing now? Um, I'm speaking a little bit quietly because it's uh, half past 11 at night on the 12th of May and uh, so it's me that has to be quiet uh, for a change uh, when recording. I, um, I'm putting this out as a heads up video because I'm hoping to have this out tomorrow or I was hoping to have this out tomorrow but it may um, go on a little bit long or further than that as i've still got quite a lot of um not editing editing to do so much but some other sort of support work uh, to complete the video and uh, uh, i've just realized that tomorrow i've got um, a few other uh, jobs uh, come my way so i'm hoping to have this out tomorrow but it might go on to the uh, to the following day but just to give you a heads up of what the contents of the uh, video here i've uh, we're taking a look at the flat slats uh, jammed uh, checklist but uh, initially we're going to go over a systems overview and um, just putting some you know, context to the flaps and the slaps and the various systems within it I uh, also take a look at the um, a quick revision of the uh, hydraulic failures not in any great detail there are links to these videos when they come up um, to the green and blue and the green and yellow and what they mean and just uh, um, how that affects our flats and slap uh, uh, operation and uh, configuration. Uh, we then take a look at the indices on the EWD and just, uh, just I, I guess, review our knowledge and what that's trying to say to us, including what indications we see on the PFD and uh, the difference between the flap lever position and the actual uh, flap and slat uh, position out on the wing and what indications we see on the PFD. And then lastly, we go over a walkthrough of a failure on an approach with the flaps stuck at zero when flaps two is selected and uh, revision from uh, the SCTM and a walkthrough on the uh, QRH. So uh, hopefully I get this out to you tomorrow, if not soon after. Um, be safe, keep the plate spinning and I will talk to you again soon.